You're watching Hoops Highlights, brought to you by Moody's Tire and Auto Service in Franklin. For honesty and service comes first. Serving Williamson County for over 70 years. Late in the third quarter, Brentwood's Jenny Roy steps past the Dixon County defense for the layup. The Lady Bruins led 31-26, but this Region 6 AAA championship was just getting warmed up. About three minutes later, Lele Carter pulls up and forces a 33 all tie in the fourth. The atmosphere, it was incredible. The atmosphere was incredible. I think that without our fans that were just here, we would not have pulled it out. I think they helped us. Still tied, Carter feeds Emily Beard for the bucket in the lead. Brentwood responds on the inbound. Abby Sheely for three. Lady Bruins by one. Dixon County finds Peyton Grove, who scores inside. The rivalry battle keeps going. On the inbound, Taylor Sexton knocks down the jumper, down to 142 to play. After a pair of free throws from Carter to take a 39-38 edge, it's Roy who gets free on the baseline. Brentwood takes a 40-39 lead with just over a minute to play. She's a good player and just it is about five on five. It's not one on one. So when it comes down to it, it's a team game. So she's going to make her shots. I'm going to make mine. But it's going to be Brentwood versus Dixon at the end. Back many years ago, the last time we made it to the state tournament, we played Henry County four times. And we were hoping that and we both made it to the state tournament. And we were hoping for a fifth time. And that would mean that we were in the championship game. So wouldn't that be wonderful? for Dixon County Brentwood to be meeting again five times. That'd be awesome. Down to 36 seconds to play. Beard attacks the baseline and uses the reverse to give Dixon the edge. Brentwood comes right back. Watch the senior Roy shouting orders from the middle, trying to break loose. Sheely gets her the ball out of the double team. Roy's pass is deflected, but right back to her. The senior hits with four Lady Cougars around her to get Brentwood the lead. Grove fouled on the offensive rebound, put back two shots, 6.7 seconds to go. We have a thing in practice that we always say, and it's glad it's me. And I was really saying that tonight. I was like, glad it's me. Um, I know that our team's worked so hard, and I was not going to let two free throws keep us from winning. So I knew I had to come in clutch and pull them out. Two for two and the lead. Dixon uses their foul to give, and Roy can't get a clean look. Dixon escapes to host their first sectional since 1998.